I thank Snowbread T. Joshua for what you are doing in our family. Now we have come to collect our scholarship for this term. Emmanuel, my name is Christian Abumere. I thank God I also came out first in my class. Many of these children have missed years of their education due to various circumstances, but thanks to the Synagogue Church of All Nations Scholarship Program, they have returned to school encouraged and inspired to do more, many of them taking first position in examinations. As Prophet TB Joshua says, we should see our contribution to others as an assignment from God. Whichever area you are strong in, you are expected to use it generously to strengthen your fellow brother. Emmanuel, my name is Stephen Aka. I'm from Ghana. I got admission to Pentecost University, but there's no one to help. So a friend introduced me to watch Emmanuel TV, how Prophet TB Joshua has been a vessel to bless others. So I watched and I decided to take a faith to come so that the man of God will entreat me to God's favor so that he may help me. I don't have anyone to help me. So man of God, please, please do me a kind so that I'll be entered to the university. This is my ID card and this is my bill. My bill is uh, 1,400 Ghana CD, equivalent to 145,000 Naira. I'm pursuing banking and finance. Let's listen to these little people who are also beneficiaries of the Synagogue Church of All Nations Scholarship Program. Emmanuel, my name is Anu Luakpo Yekunle. The person standing beside me is my mother. This is my result. I became second in my class. I know that next time I'll become first. God bless Prophet TB Joshua and the people working under him. What we are seeing has been made possible by Prophet TB Joshua and the support of our Emmanuel TV partners worldwide. Everything we have today comes from God and everything we will receive in our future will come from Him. All we are doing is giving back what we have received from His generous hands. Your love, your strength, your time, your money, your faith, your kindness. What have you to give? Give it in humility and reverence to God. What you have in your hands today is a solution to someone else in need. My name is Mrs. Abu Mere Philomena Sunday. These are my children. We come to Synagogue of Church of All Nations today to collect the scholarship of the children. May the good Lord bless our daddy in the Lord TB Joshua and may God reward him and promote a ministry from glory to glory in the mighty name of Jesus. Really, God really transformed my life in this ministry. He changed me from poverty to the glory of Almighty God. He washed away my tears. He wiped away pains in my life. I give God all the glory. And I thank God today in the life of Emmanuel team that they are supporting this family, the other's widow and the orphan, the fatherless, the widowers. I thank God today for God that make them to touch this family. That God Almighty should reward them and bless them abundantly in the mighty name of Jesus. My past was from dustbin to dustbin. That way I was eating for. There was no hope. But when I come to the synagogue of all nations, I now realize there is hope, there is life. And God removed me from that pain to Zion of God. What has been the change and the, the result you have seen in the life of your children since they became a part of the scholarship scheme supported by the ministry of Prophet T.B. Joshua? They are first in the class. And I'm so happy about it. 
So I give glory to God. I come to receive their school scholarship. The money is 221,550. My name is Christiana Bumeria from Medo State. I'm 19 years old. My life changed very well because before I used to go to school, but now when the man of God gave us scholarship, I started going to school. I do well in my school. I took first position in my class. I tell God Almighty for what you have done in my life and life of my brothers and sisters. I want to be a newscaster. My name is Frank Sunday Abu Mary. My age is 15. When we came to Sinango Church of Foundation, man of God helped us and provide apartment for us and give us some of 500,000. And we thank God for that. And since when we have been coming to this church, our life has changed very well and we are going to school. Praise God that he should continue blessing the man of God, Senior Prophet Tip Joshua forever, O Lord, in Jesus' name. And I perform very well in my exam, and I'm happy for that. This is my result that I took first in the class. I'm happy because I want to be an electrical engineer. My name is Esther. I am seven years old. What are you holding in your hands? My report card. I got first in my class. I thank God. My name is James Sunday Abumere. I'm 17 years old. Here's my, my results. I took first position and I'm happy about that. Now, uh, I was, I'm happy now I'm going to school. Uh, before I cannot go to school for three years, thank the man of God. I want to become a, a lawyer to the glory of God. And we want to advise our family that as they have been blessed by the word of God, they should stay ruled by the word of God to maintain their relationship with our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. My name is Stephen Aka. I'm from Ghana. The problem that brought me to Sinago Church of All Nations is that I got admission to Pinnacle University and uh, there was no hope for me to enter because my parents are very poor to help me. So I decided to come and to Sinago Church and indeed when I came, the man of God has actually helped me and has be a help to me indeed. A friend of mine introduced me to watch Emmanuel TV, how God has been using Prophet TV Joshua as a vessel to bless the poor and the people who are in lack. Yeah, this is my first time of coming. I'm very surprised about how the man of God did to me. I'm very happy and I think I'll have the ability to study. The man of God gave me 145000 naira. For now, I think I have a hope because the man of God has helped me and I cannot go to school. So I'm going to study banking and finance. Many are hopeless. Uh, are not able to go to school, what advice can you give them? What, what word of encouragement could you give to such people? Okay, uh, my advice to them is that um, they shouldn't look hope in whatever they want to do. They shouldn't trust in any man because God is the only one to trust. And I, I promise, come my first class. Amen. Well, that's wonderful. And uh, we know that uh, by God's grace, all things are possible. That day, millions of naira were given to these students to sponsor them in their education. The ministry of the Synagogue Church of All Nations is committed to the cause of the less privileged. These are just a few instances of support for the less privileged. If we were to bring you all, this documentary would not contain them. Beneficiaries of the Synagogue Church of All Nations scholarship program receive financial assistance for all their needs on a regular basis to help them succeed with their lives. How many people have you helped? How many lives have you changed? Remember, Successful people are simply problem solvers. We have orphans, physically challenged, widows and widowers, the lonely and the needy. People want to change. People want to succeed with their lives. They just don't know how to go about it. And you have what they need to succeed. Jesus said that it is more blessed to give than to receive. You will begin to succeed with your life when the hurts and problems of others begin to matter to you when you start to feel for others with all your substance. Today, the church is being awakened to her responsibilities towards the needy. I have a role to play. You have a role to play. This is not the time to sit on the fence. It is time to act faith. It is our duty to take care of the needy in our midst, for there is a promise of God attached to this. These less privileged need us to discover their direction and goals in life. Someone is out there, waiting for you for a lifetime. As sons and daughters of love, we should see giving as an assignment from God.
because there is no love that does not express itself in giving. You cannot afford to fail them. Failing them is failing God. Now we want to open our lips. Every garment of sin, every garment of iniquities, every garment of unrighteousness, begin to remove it right now. Tout vêtement de péché, tout vêtement d'iniquité, commencez à les enlever dans le nom de Jésus-Christ. Vêtement de l'injustice. Commencez à remover toute vestidura de injustice, de iniquité et de pecado, en le nom poderoso de Jésus-Christ. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. I want you to take the word, believe. This is the word for you at this time. Remember Joshua. He said to his people, shout hallelujah. And what happened to the Jericho? He said, shout hallelujah. And all of them shout hallelujah. They follow his instruction. If you are going to take me at my word, let me see your hand. The way I'm going to speak to you is not mine. Take it. Are you ready? So when we say remove every garment of iniquity, every garment of sin, unrighteousness, we are talking of those problems that could hinder you. 